Uh, yes. Today I will be playing Final Smash 2. Now, what Final Smash 2 is, is a video, it, it's a game, a Flash game, where you literally create your own characters, set their AI, and everything. Now, my main goal for today was V for Vendetta, making him for the simple fact that I like his character and his stature. Uh, luckily it had the guy Fox mask, but I couldn't find the trench coat or any of that stuff, so I tried to, uh, even him out the best I could. I made him to where he's a very versatile character, and his main projectiles are throwing daggers. They are throwing knives and shurikens. Now, he has one superpower, which is I could not neglect him from having any superpowers, and that is the teleport he teleports backwards away from his enemy and he goes from there now what I did for him was I made him to where his AI he taunts like crazy he's making fun of the people who are trying to empower him but they know they can't so I made him for that specific reason now, the reason I'm playing this game and making these characters are for the simple fact I want to get back into the catch of uh, commentating on the vi on the fights that I saw. I've been pretty burned out of Smash Flash. I don't want it anymore. I just don't. But, uh, yes, I will be playing the new updated version. Don't get me wrong there. But his opponent is something I got off of the site. I did not download this. There is a boss character that I also downloaded that I'm not sure that he will be able to handle. Uh, so, this character is more like a grunt in the... It's meant for a society. That's why I picked him here is because that is the guard of a society. And that is everything that a... Well, this was meant for an oppressive society, which is everything that V is against. So, please do not get it mad at me about how poorly I depicted V for Vendetta. I tried my best. Uh, I will be making more characters in the future for this game, and let's just start with the fight, why don't we? Okay, so, as you see here, he already starts throwing his knives. Uh, He's also very good at jumping, which is he uses his, to his advantage. As you see, he taunts there. And he just used his teleporting move, which will help him. He does he does it again. I don't know why he keeps doing it. But as you see, he has those shurikens that he throws and uses to his advantage. Now, don't get me wrong. He is good at martial arts, but I'm afraid his AI is a little bit dumb for this game for the simple fact that the things that I set up wouldn't exactly work out for him he broke that uh, grab there the it's trying to grab him and put him down he he's very unaware of what's going on around him as it seems uh, if he loses I'm sorry guys I can't change the outcut this is AI just remember uh, yeah those throwing knives will help him in the long run as he tries to throw one which is obviously out of range here he he kind of is one of the more unsuccessful characters I, I have ever created in this game as he's not that powerful in terms I tried with him I really did but I can't really help when he's when he doesn't perform well. It, he mainly relies on these throwing knives. I made it that way so he could stay at a perfect range. Uh, so he can battle other characters from a certain range in this game. Uh, he likes getting like that. I made him to where he seems martial artsy. It, it, no, he's getting low. He, Dude, fight. Oh, Start throwing your stuff, buddy. Now, I can tell if he's bad, because this is a grunt that I, I'm using for every character review. 
I can't really help the fact that he uses... He looks more like he's trying... To eat. He's trying to stay at a distance when he's close. He don't know what to do. Which is, that's not what I tailored him for. I want him to be a versatile character in both fields. I'm going to have to go in and edit him. But he really... Oh, he won. I'd say I give this victory to the, him because of the... I'd say I give this victory to him because of his throwing knives. He didn't want to use his game for different... He didn't want to use his game for the uh, stuff that he had in martial arts techniques. He seemed like he wanted to avoid those fairly well. But... That's not what I tailored this character for. I didn't tailor him to be like that. Uh, so, what I'm going to do next is I'm a cut out. Because this game requires things called smash codes that I have to copy and paste, which as I said, into a folder of my own. And I have some stuff on there I don't want you to see. So, I'll be right back. Now, in this match, I put him up against someone named Jason Glow. His main attribute is the air attack that he puts out. Uh, I don't... I can't really pinpoint if he's stronger or weaker than uh, the CO guard. All I know is that he can match up to Fire Dawn pretty well. You don't know who Fire Dawn is. He will come into play later. But... What I'm going to do here is I'm going to put them in an alley situation. I'm going to see how good V really is and see if he needs a little improving. Because I want to see big things from V later on in the future. Not this uh, very weak version of him I just saw. If it looked like to you like he was doing fine and that he was beating up a metal guy, that's good for you. But from what it looked like to me, he was getting his ass handed to him by a grunt. So, I'm just hoping for the best in this battle, and this will determine his fate with the editing. Okay, so, he's already heading away. He used his teleport move. He, oh, he just totally decimated it. Oh, no. What are you doing? He, he, Jason is perhaps one of the most versatile characters I have in this game. Uh... Uh, he was made for the simple fact that, why ain't you using your moves? Now, this, he's not performing well. I'm going to have to go in and I'm going to have to fix his AI. Those knives do quite a bit of damage on Jason. I think he might have a chance against Fired On. He, I don't, I don't think V has this one in the bag. Uh, I didn't think this through before I showed him. Uh, so, that just shows that he is not good for one of the big leagues. So, what I'm going to do later on is I'm going to post a second review of his character, but amped. What do I mean by amped? I mean, his AI is fixed. I saw nothing wrong with his attributes. He was fine with his attributes. But his AI is just stupid. And I don't know who would agree with me on that. I know I agree with I know I agree to that. Uh but I'm gonna have to go in and I'm gonna have to fix him for that. Uh so I'm running out of time anyways. I was planning on uh reviewing Fired On or something for the extra time, but V Vert got out of hand for me because I wanted him to be like a big character in this series. Uh, but sadly, he couldn't match up to what I wanted him to be, so that's why I'm going to edit him and add new things to him so he can become what I always wanted him to kind of like do. So there's going to be another V for Vendetta video today, and I'm going to put on... I'm going to put him back up against him for the first match because I know he can defeat the CO guard and stuff. 
Uh, so I will be back today. Uh, this is Clyde Believe coming from the Clyde channel. If you liked this video, uh, hit the subscribe button and I will be back next time. Sorry.